Hello, Jesse Good here, back with another video. Today I'm reviewing the LEGO Nexo Knights Ultimate Robin set. It has 75 pieces, one minifigure, and it retails for $10 in the United States. So here is Robin equipped with the Mechmaster Nexo Power. There's also the Chicken Power Nexo Power included, and the Storm Dragon Nexo Power included. Now, for this uh, Mechmaster equipment, you can see it's very, very bulky. And there's also these two flick missiles on the back, or push missiles. Because if you push them, they shoot very far and very hard and you can see that the equipment like i said is very bulky but uh once you take all that off which is pretty simple you just remove it from the back like that you can see that he's using the ultimate uh little armor piece um but in a new kind of just plain silver color which that's pretty neat and also he has the nexo Knight's shield, which you know is a standard fare. You take that off with the printed Nexo power, and you got one stud and two studs on the back, and his accessory is a little sword. And my favorite part of Robin is his hair piece because it's actually really darn cool. Uh, it's Luke's hair in kind of a caramel color, but he doesn't have any alternate facial expression. And you can see his printing on his torso is actually really detailed and carries on to the back. And he does also come in a poly bag, uh, which is kind of interesting to note, both out that armor piece. And here's how he looks with the chicken power. He just has a little chicken leg, and he uses that helmet found in the Lego Kingdoms line. Here's his storm dragon power, where the missiles are replaced with blue, trans blue ones, and he also has that little lightning coming out of his hand. So for Ultimate Robin, the build format is the same as all the other Ultimate sets. Chicken power has two chicken legs being held, and that's little helmet being held on a cylinder piece and all the way to the back you can see there's nothing really interesting but uh, on this side for the storm dragon you have this little lightning rod being held and these two missiles and then you have this nice little uh, mechanics kind of box and it's kind of just put to the side they don't actually have it used in the final power they just kind of show it on the side in the final power in the instruction booklet but hey, it's an extra piece and it's actually a really nice accessory. And of course you could easily just take off Ultimate Robin off those two little jumper pieces and then you could easily put them back on. And here's the Ultimate Robin box. And you get one instruction booklet. So overall, Ultimate Robin is one of my least favorites of the Ultimate sets. Robin himself comes in a poly bag that's almost exactly like this, like his uh, actual minifigure, but the only difference between that minifigure and this one is that this one has a little nice armor piece, which is exclusive, but still, the armor piece itself isn't so interesting. I mean, it's not translucent or anything, it's just a regular silver one, which I know why they didn't do it translucent. It's because he isn't a knight, and he doesn't really have a certain color, but still, it just doesn't, you know, it's not, it's not that appealing compared to the other ones. And the actual build itself, I find the these back blasters be a little bit too bulky and uh, the two Nexo powers are all right though I kind of like the chicken one um, that's a nice print um, but other than that I mean it's a okay you know I mean it's it's a good deal the ten dollars is a good deal it's just that it's kind of less of a good deal because the minifigure isn't so interesting and he comes in another set almost identical so I'll write this set a B but that's really it for this review I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys later bye